What's going on y'all? Welcome back to the channel. Hey man, check it out. I'm going to show you how to properly connect your drum set to Logic Pro right off the bat so that you don't run into any mapping issues and this should also help out a lot with any triggering issues as well. So, right here, right now, on this channel, it's about to go down. So, you ready? Here we go! Alright, check it out. If you've bought your drum set and brought it home and started playing with it and you get ready to start recording, you probably notice that you're having triggering issues in your DAW. Um, and I know there's a download for those of you guys that are already in the comments clicking. Uh, listen, there's a there's a download that you can get at SimmonsDrums.net, uh, I believe it is. Go over to Simmons and get that download that will fix your module. But this is a different triggering issue that find that you'll find in the DAW when you're trying to record. So I want to make certain that you know how to record properly and and stop some of those triggering issues and make certain that the mapping is working properly. So here's how you do it. We're gonna pull up Logic, and once we got Logic, I've already got a drum sound pulled up. And what we're gonna do is set this up so that it knows what we're playing. What you wanna do is you wanna click on the drum here so that you pull up. And normally when you open this, it'll be closed like this where it says drum kit designer. You wanna go down here and you see where it says mapping, input mapping, go figure. You wanna click here and you normally want, probably wanna set it to V drum. V drum is like that standard, it's really like the Roland V drum, but it's kinda of like the standard for uh, your electric drums. Select that one, try it out. If it doesn't work, go to the opposite one. But usually, the V drum is the one that's gonna make your drum talk to Logic properly to stop some of the triggering issues in Logic because you will run into those issues even though you've already upgraded your uh, module with the download from Simmons. So I don't want you to think that there's something wrong with the Simmons module. It's actually your drum is not talking to Logic properly. So that's how you do it. You go in, click on the drum here, open it up, go down to the drum kit designer, drop down the menu, select V drum, and you should be ready to go if you ran into those. If you use a Simmons drum set, you definitely need to do this if you're gonna try to record yourself. So if you haven't already, click this little thing right here so that you can subscribe to my channel for all these new videos that are coming. And also, make sure you click right here to check out one of my next videos, and I will catch y'all next time. Peace.